It's been a while since we've been up American Fork Canyon, and I finally got my truck inspected, got the emissions done, which makes it a lot easier to get the fat bikes up the canyon to go biking. A lot of times what we like to do is we start here at uh, the Pine Hollow Trailhead and go up the Alpine Loop Scenic Byway Trail, or road. We go up the road past uh, Altamont and then we get you get up here to the turn off to uh, Timpanookee. One way to go is to uh, go up to the towards the campground there and then start on this trail and, and uh, take that trail around. But uh, we decided today that the idea would be to continue on the road until the, where that trail crosses the road here and then uh, go there towards Salamander Flat and then at Salamander Flat uh, you continue on down towards the Pine Hollow Trail Actually, that's a little bit of a climb up towards the Pine Hollow Trail and then at, go down the Pine Hollow Trail back to the Pine Hollow Trail head and it makes a fun little loop. But it turned out that when we got to where the trail crosses the road, as you can see, it wasn't very rideable. So we decided to uh, do the alternate plan, which would be to uh, continue up the road, and you can take that road and go up to the summit, and then at that point you could maybe come down uh, the, this trail here that goes back down to the road, or uh, there's also the, the trail that goes up here to this little snow station. You can go down um, the snow gauge trail back to the beginning, um, if the trails are packed well enough, you can actually go back, you can go up the, these trails, but uh, the conditions here, the snow is pretty deep and whatever. During the summer, uh, a lot of times what we like to do is come down the uh, ridge, uh, actually it's kind of going up, go up uh, Ridge Trail 157 and you can take that up here and then you can continue, you can turn and go down Pine Hollow, or if you continue on that past up, uh, past Mud Springs, up here to uh, the four-way up here at the top of my uh, map and then brings that back down here towards Cascade Springs and then you can uh, loop that around back up to the summit and then go back out on on the ridge trail and uh, and then go down the top part of Pine Hollow and uh, back the trail and end up back at the at Timpanookee which is where, where where we usually start uh, in the summer so that makes a fun little trail and you can do a lot of these things in the winter um, when the conditions are good but it seems for some whatever reason most people are uh, doing their uh, fat biking the snow biking earlier in the year and, and uh, after the new year the trails just don't seem to get as much use and they weren't quite as packed and besides that uh, my uh, rear tire has a slow leak in it so if I uh, start with the air pressure low enough to be able to really have traction by the time I get done I'm pretty much flat and so I for this trip I had a little bit too much air in the, that rear tire but uh, like I said I couldn't really let it out to get the traction <music>